But up first tonight and developing the manhunt to find an escaped inmate who's eluded authorities for a week now. Gonzalo Lopez somehow managed to slip out of his cuffs on a prison transport bus and a metal cage and getting away from two correctional officers. The massive search is happening in Centerville, two hours north of Houston. That's where our Brittany Ford is and officers perhaps looking to change the focus of that search, Brittany. Well, Lynn, that's right, and officers have been here as a staging area over the last couple of weeks. You can see, or la week rather, you can see that they're still holding off a portion of this roadway here. Officials telling me that they're planning to move this search effort to a different part of the area this afternoon into the weekend. No details on where, but you can take a look at your screen right now. This is video the Department of Criminal Justice released just yesterday, giving us a better idea of what's happening over the last couple of days here in this part of Leon County. Officials addressing questions that there may have been a car following the prison bus between Gatesville and Highway 7 where Lopez was escaped. A spokesperson for the department says no suspicious activity has been found. As this manhunt continues, they had this message to the community. This is a very dangerous man. Back in 2005, he killed somebody with a pickaxe. In 2004, he shot at an officer. So. If he has that device, whatever it was that he used to cut through the door and also to stab the officer, folks need to be aware he may still have that on him. Now, if you see Lopez, you should call 911 or your local law enforcement agency immediately. There had been rumors that Lopez was potentially arrested in the Waco area. We were able to confirm with Waco police that that rumor circulating online is in fact false. Mia. The search carries on tonight. Brittany Ford, thank you.